So as anything uh, is updated, we'll bring you that information. On the line with us this morning is uh, Foster Arnett, Jr., the Honorable uh, Clerk of uh, Knox County, Tennessee. Foster, good morning. Good morning, my friend. How are you? I'm doing fine, sir. I hope that you are. Yes, sir. I'm on my way to church. So everything's good. Thank you. Now, uh, let me warn you, in studio with me is uh, Megan Venable, columnist. Good morning, Foster. <laughs> Hello, how are you? Wonderful, thank you. Have you all met good. before? Y'all know each other? Well, I mean, we've met, but just in passing. Okay. You know, Megan writes the uh, people and party section, Foster. For us guys, it was uh, the society page. Yes, exactly. That's the section my wife grabbed first out of the <laughs> paper on Sunday morning. So, uh, Tell you do a thank good job, you. Megan. Yay. <laughs> Foster. You're Sam's daughter, right? I am. Yes, I yeah. am. I, I, yeah, I, I tend to not admit that in public, but... I understand. Uh, I tell you what, he is a great guy. Oh, he's he's wonderful. He is a, a, a wonderful man. I lived with him twice as an adult, and he is a jolly, jolly fella. Yes, he is. Foster, we got word uh, late yesterday afternoon, at least it was reported, I don't know when you first heard, of the death of uh, former mayor and uh, your good friend, uh, Kyle C. Testerman. That's right. I got called. He passed away about uh, 6.30 yesterday morning. Uh, he was in uh, Tanova, uh assisted living care up in, uh, it used to be the old St. Mary's. And uh, I'm real, real good friends with Kyle and, of course, his daughter, uh, Janet and his other daughter Muffet and then his son Ben. They're just a, a fine, fine group of, of people. And I was saddened to hear the news, but, you know, we were able to get the tennis courts uh, named after him. And we had lunch together and spent some time together. And you, you could tell Kyle wasn't feeling quite well. And uh, he was a great guy and a good friend. And uh, I'm certainly going to miss him. Well, I did not want to impose upon the family uh, j just so soon after. Uh, and I thought of you and knew that you were close. And, and uh, so I called to ask you to tell a little bit about the man. Of course, any any trained monkey can read the newspaper and, and you know, recount what they wrote about him as being mayor. But tell us something about the man, uh, Kyle Testament. Well, Kyle was very passionate about Knoxville. And, uh, you know, if, if you were around Kyle a lot, as I was, you know, he, he could get quite upset about things in the right way. Um, you know, over what was going on, but he was the major force behind uh, redeveloping the old city, uh, bringing um, the World's Fair to Knoxville, and, uh, you know, he was just on fire for, for this city and its people, and he's very compassionate, uh, funny guy. Uh, you'd be around him, he'd crack little jokes, and uh, he was just, he, he loved life, he loved his family, and uh, we, uh, you know, we're going to miss him. What was his role in the World's Fair? I, I knew that he had some role in it, but I didn't realize he was the one that initiated it. He, no, he, he worked with other people, but he was the main linchpin, if you will, uh, to talk to the people who were putting together...